Hello everyone, uh, so this is my open PMP build, uh, Roybus is the name of the machine. Um, it's essentially as uh, 3D printed as possible. So all these brackets and joints and things everywhere, these are all uh, 3D printed. Um, this machine is uh, open source. Um, uh, I don't have a lot of this stuff online yet, but if anyone does want it, they just have to let me know. Um, so uh, we are using the CP40 nozzles on this, and you can see there the only machine parts are those nozzle adapters. Um, so, and they're pretty straightforward. They're just a piece of aluminum with uh, a pretty accurate hole bored through them. They just need to be very concentric. That was the only uh, constraint with those. I like the CP40 nozzles because you can change the, uh, the tips on them um, really easily without uh, having to have a weird head. Uh, so the machine is driven entirely from the slush engine. Um, uh, so that controls the valves, the lighting and everything else. And it, uh, it's networked. So uh, that's really nice as well. Uh, I just need to get the cameras networked as well. That's the computer running everything. Here you can see the vision. Um, so the lighting uh, is pretty bad. Um, I've got to fix that. It's just a bunch of WS2812s like stuffed in a housing. Uh, I didn't put too much effort into that. So that's something I need to redo. Uh, so this head design is pretty unique. Um, so it's got the two heads actually located between the rails. Um, this creates too much space between the heads and I don't actually think it's a very good way of doing things. It was just something I wanted to try. Um, uh, so there, uh, so at the moment I'm working on a second version of this machine. I learned a lot from doing this first build. Um, so for example, right now it's running really, really slow. The reason it's running so slow is because, uh, the bearings, these linear bearings are, uh, not aligned very well. Um, and they cause a lot of friction and it causes the belts to skip when I try and run the machine at high speeds. Um, so uh, that's something that I need to perfect, uh, figure out a better bearing alignment system or just choosing a different type of bearing. These are really, really cheap bearings. Um, but I think that I am going to stick with uh, the linear rod as opposed to using rails, um, just because it's uh, slightly cheaper. Um, and also uh, it makes for, I think, a simpler, leaner design. Uh, so these are just the feeder holders. Uh, if anyone wants to build this machine, just let me know, but uh, I wouldn't recommend it. Uh, if you wait a couple weeks, I'll have revision two done.